Okay, so hello everyone. I'm here para ituro sa inyo kung paano uh, mag-download ng Zoom app sa inyo mga PC or laptop. So, let's start! Okay, so ways and how to download Zoom on PC or laptop. So, ano nga ba yung Zoom? Bakit importante ito sa pag-aaral natin or sa mga presentations natin? So, let's find out kung ano yung Zoom. So, ang Zoom, Zoom is a cloud-based video communications app that allows you to set up virtual video and audio conferencing, webinars, live chats, screen sharing, and other collaborative capabilities. Uh, collaborative capabilities. Also, Zoom users can choose to record sessions, collaborate on projects, and share or an annotate on others' screens, all with one easy-to-use platform. Next, Zoom is a web-based video conferencing tool with a local desk client and a mobile, mobile app that allows users to meet online with or without video. So, next slide, please. Okay. So, I want you to go sa Google, Google device or Google, how, no, Google, and then after, you have to search here, Zoom app download. Then after you, you're, Click enter, lalabas nyo yung download Zoom, uh, download center Zoom. Once nandun yun, you have to click it. After you click, ito yung lalabas. So, lalabas tong Zoom client for meetings. Zoom client for meetings, ito yung my yellow star. So, sinadya ko talaga pa, for you para hindi kayo malito. And then after, click download. So, after you click the download, ito yung lalabas. Okay. So, after you click the download, here, this downloads, ito yung lalabas. There's an arrow, blue or violet arrow, but to, sh but to. and then, so, mag, the download siya from Google sa papuntang laptop mo or PC mo. Then, after that one, you have to Click this arrow here, nandito sa arrow, arrow key ko, and then after, once you click it, there's a open. So, ito yung nasa orange na arrow din. O, click open. After you click open, ito yung lalabas. So, ito yun. So, wait until finish installing. So, after, diba, nag-open nag ka after open, ito yung nag-install na siya sa laptop mo. After that one, okay, so ito yung lalabas. Zoom, join me, join a meeting, then sign in. Since you are new to that app, Zoom app, so you have to create your account first. So you have to click sign in. Ito yung sign in. After clicking the sign in, ito yung lalabas. So, since wala pa tayo, as what I told you, wala pa nga tayong Zoom Active, uh, Zoom account. So, we have to create, we have here, sign up for free. Makikita ito sa black na arrow. After that one, after clicking that one, ito yung lalabas sa screen. Okay. So, for verification, please confirm your date of birth. So, you have to input your birthday. So, don't worry. This data will not be stored. So, safe lang yung birthday mo. After clicking, after putting your, putting your birthday, you have to click continue. After clicking continue, ito yung lalabas. Yes. So, ito yung lalabas. You work email, uh, your work email address. So, you have to write or you have to input your active Gmail or email account. Yahoo ba yan? Gmail ba yan? Ano yung ginagamit mo? As long as it's, as, as it's active. So, okay lang talaga siya. And then, 
So, disclaimer lang po sa iyong word na input to. Sorry po. Merong spelling siya kasi hindi ginawa ko po to 12 a.m. And then, also your verification, there's an N also. So, sorry po. Input your active email or Gmail for verification of your account. After putting it, you have to click sign up. After clicking the sign up, so ito yung lalabas. So, we've sent an email. Yung Gmail na ginamit mo, yung active Gmail na ginamit mo, ginamit mo kanina, so ito yun. Click the confirmation link in that email to begin using Zoom. After that one, so when you go to your Gmail account, active Gmail account, so ito yung lalabas. So, hello, your name, welcome to Zoom. To activate your account, please click the button below to verify your email address. So, you have to click the active account. Ito yung red arrow. After clicking that one, ito yung lalabas. So, welcome to Zoom. So, hi, your Gmail account. Your account has been successfully created. So, please let your name, list, I mean, list your name and create a password to continue. So, first, write your first name, last name, password. Remember, please lang, do not forget your password. This is very, very important. You cannot log in or sign in if if you forget your password, so please now don't forget. Pa first password, then confirm the password, and then click continue. After clicking continue, ito yung lalabas. Are you signing up on behalf of a school? If yes, then click yes. If no, click no, then continue. After continuing, ito yung lalabas. So, invite your colleagues to create their own free Zoom account today. Why invite? So, for me, I don't have, I don't know yet kung may mga Zoom ba yung friends ko. So, what I did is here, may captcha siya. So, I had, there's a box and then you just click, you have to click the box and then ito yung lalabas check mark. I'm not a robot. And then, it's either you can invite, you can invite if you want. Then, for me, ginawa ko, skip this step. After skipping the step, ito yung lalabas. So, you already have an activated Zoom account. So, after that one, so, I want you to go to your, I want you to go to your desktop or sa laptop or PC mo. Then, sa search box, you have to search Zoom. After searching, uh, searching the Zoom, Ito yung lalabas, start zoom, then right click, again, right click, start zoom, and then after it, we're gonna, lalabas tong run as administrator. So, yun yung ikiklik mo. So, don't worry, I already write here the way and kung paano gagawin, so, para hindi na kayo mahirapan. Next is, ito yung lalabas after you click the run as administrator. So, this time, since you already have an activated account, meron ka ng account mo sa Zoom app, so you have to click sign in. Here, click sign in. Okay. So, when you click the word sign in, ito yung lalabas. So, this time, do not click sign up for free. I'm so sorry for this one. This is not... Hindi po ito yun. Ito po yung sign in. So, you have to sign in your email address na na-activate mo na. Then, also your password na sinabi ko kanina na very important at huwag kalimutan. Then, after, check keep me signed in. Ito yun. Keep me signed in. I forgot to check this one. Keep me signed in. Ibig sabihin nito na if you're gonna check this one, every time you, you go to your Zoom app, then automatically lalabas na, meron ka na, nandun ka na. Di gaya ng ito, wala siyang box. So, if ever wala kasi siyang box, once I go to my Zoom, so I have to sign in again. So, parang arami ko nagagawin. So, better this one, keep this, keep me signed in. Better this one. After, keep me signed in, click sign in. After, click sign in. Ito yon Yes, meron ka ng activated in a Zoom app. So, meron ka na, see, meron kang new meeting, meron kang join meeting, schedule, share screen. Uh, new meeting is ito yung, yung, ikaw yung host, ikaw yung magdadala sa mga members mo, papunta sa, sa meeting sessions nyo. For, which is a join meeting, join meeting is sa salika, sa mga Zoom meeting na meron. Scheduled meeting, so you can schedule the meeting. Share screen, 
Okay. So, for the information lang po sa lahat. So, what I am using this time in having a, my presentation for you is a Zoom also. So, next video, I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you on how to use Zoom also. Okay? So, once again, thank you so much for listening on this and this information that I shared to you. So, hopefully, makakatulong siya sa inyo, especially this time. Because it's very, very helpful sa mga online classes natin, teachers, students, sa mga professors, sa lahat-lahat, presentations. So, thank you, thank you so much, everyone. Keep safe and thanks for watching. Thank you so much. Bye!